How friends welcome to my channel this is game farming simulator 20 to game amazing game follow me like and subscribe okay 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 who doesn't know about motorized vehicles especially now motorized vehicles have become the most widely used means of transportation do you know the meaning of motorized vehicles motorized vehicles are vehicles that are driven using machines or technical equipment as propulsion this vehicle is usually used as land transportation there are various types of motorized vehicles such as cars buses motorbikes off-road vehicles light trucks to heavy trucks this classification varies depending on where the vehicle is produced motor vehicles and their types usually motorized vehicles are chosen for personal use or for office purposes or only two adults in fact there are many types of motorized vehicles especially now that technology is advancing which makes it possible to create new types of vehicles however currently motorized vehicle types are divided into two namely Hi my friends, welcome to our favorite channel, here we will get to know lots of cool and amazing vehicles and be educational for friends. What is a truck? A truck is a motorized vehicle designed to transport goods. Trucks are usually larger than passenger cars and have a larger load capacity. Trucks are used for various purposes, such as goods transportation, construction, and industry. Truck capacity. Truck capacity. What factors influence truck capacity? Truck capacity is influenced by several factors, including Truck type, different truck types have different capacities. Larger trucks usually have a larger capacity. In addition, the type of truck is determined based on the size and configuration of the truck's wheels. Number of axles, the axles are the horizontal bars that connect the wheels. The front axle is usually used to move the vehicle, while the rear axle is used to support the load. The greater the number of axles, the greater the truck capacity. Truck dimensions, truck dimensions also 
also affect the capacity of the truck. Trucks that are longer and wider usually have a larger capacity. Another thing that influences is government regulations regarding fleet capacity limits. The transportation government stipulates that every truck must not be OOL or overdimensioned and overload. If the OOL is violated, there is a possibility that the truck will not be able to continue its journey because the goods exceed the truck's capacity. One of the most popular FTL vehicle options for businesses. The most popular FTL vehicles for business include trailers, flatbeds, and reefer trucks, each selected based on cargo type and needs. Semi-trailer trucks, ideal for large-scale goods deliveries and are often used in the logistics industry to transport goods in large quantities. Flatbed trucks, often used to transport construction materials or other large or irregular items that do not fit or are not suitable for enclosed trucks. Refrigerated truck, reefer this truck is equipped with a refrigeration unit, very suitable for transporting food, drinks or other goods that require temperature regulation. Tanker trucks, used to transport liquids or gases, such as fuel, chemicals, or water. Suitable for industries that require the transportation of liquid materials in large quantities. Container truck, suitable for shipping international or long-distance goods. This truck keep following my storyline in this content, types of heavy equipment and their functions. A scraper motor or scraper is a type of heavy equipment that is widely used in cutting slopes or embankment slopes. This heavy equipment can also be used to excavate soil between concrete buildings and can also be used to level highways. In the working process, this tool can dig the surface of the soil to a thickness slash depth of more than 2.5 millimeters and can also collect at the desired location up to a minimum thickness of more than 2.5 millimeters. Use a compactor equipped with a vibrator.ness, overhead cranes, and 